Hey guys, welcome back to another video. This is Gabe with Indigo Software, genuine Microsoft software for less. So in today's video, we've got a full walkthrough tutorial video for you guys, and we're gonna show you how to run Windows 11 on the Apple Silicon processor Mac computers. So this is gonna work on M1 or M2, and we're gonna use a software called Parallels Desktop. Now, before we get into that, if you're interested in your own copy of Windows 11, Windows 10, or other Microsoft software at a great price, Check out Indigo Software, we'll have links in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get started. All right, so the first step is to download Parallels Desktop. And we're on the website right here and we, and we can see that it was just updated to be optimized for both Intel or the Apple M series Mac computer. It's also optimized for the latest Windows 11 and Mac OS Ventura. So Parallels makes it very, very easy to run Windows from your Mac. <clears throat> and the first thing that we can do is go ahead and download this. So we're gonna click free trial and we'll click download free trial. Uh, you could also decide to just buy now. I believe you get a 14 day free trial. So we'll click the free trial and then I'm just gonna activate once we actually get into the software. All right, so we have the DMG downloaded. I'll double click to open that and then we'll double click install Parallels Desktop. And then we got a pop up here, we'll press open, uh, accept the license agreement, and then we'll need our Mac password here to give this permission, and it's gonna start by default. Now when you open it up, you're gonna see something that looks like this. So this is the really cool thing about Parallels. In the prior builds of Parallels, uh, you would typically need to download a special type of installation file for Windows 11 called a Windows 11 ARM ISO. Now we don't have to try to figure that out in this case because Parallels is gonna do it for us. If you wanna see how to manually install it with the ARM ISO, we have a Windows 11 video on Apple M1 or M2, and you can click that right here. All right, so with this, we're just gonna take the easy route and we'll click Install Windows. All right, so the installation is complete. That took a few minutes. Uh, at this point, we would put our activation key for the sake of the video, I'm not gonna do this yet. I'll just press try for 14 days. And then we'll click continue trial again. And now we're gonna go through the Windows 11 configuration. Press accept here. And here we are on the Windows 11 desktop. So at this point, we can use the start menu and go into settings. We can sign into our Microsoft account. We can also activate Windows right here. So if you click on this, and then we click on change uh, product key here. We can paste in our Windows 11 product key. Again, if you guys are interested in that, check the links in the description box below. We have Windows 11 available at a great price. Uh, but we can sign into our Microsoft account. We can do any personalization and basic setup that we would want to do. But we are successfully running Windows 11 at this point. So we can X out of this and then just quitting parallel will shut down the virtual machine. All right, guys, so that's gonna do it for today's video. If you found the video helpful, we'd really appreciate a like, comment, subscribe, and share. And if you have any questions, drop those in the comment section below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.